my wait hold on am i doing this right by far the weirdest thing about having braids is finding hairs that are not mine in places they shall not be why did i pull out a hair from my backpack that is light brown riddle me that Nicki minaj hi everybody welcome back to my youtube channel i am in the car because um i'm about to go get my sushi that i've been waiting for all day i already ordered so i have to like wait 15 minutes and i just got out of bible class so basically i'm ready for my day to actually start it's friday and today is gonna be the day the way i'm holding this camera is like so i don't know you can't see my hand but it, just imagine like <sighs> anyways today's gonna be the day i finish draft whatever of my second project project number two it gets confusing because i never am like so explicit about what i'm talking about like what books i write and whatever because like it's embarrassing <laughs> like i refuse i don't know just a little bit so basically i have the first project that i've ever done ever this is project number two so project number two is a completely different like set of books that i want to do um and yeah if you don't know me i'm madison i write books and what's crazy is like i don't even publish them yet so at this point it's just it's like i can't even justify the hobby like when i say i write they're like oh have you no i'm 19 what do you think is gonna happen right now but one day what's crazy is one day one day i will be and and then it's gonna all click if i ever do become rich and famous one day these videos are gonna be real cute then aren't they until then i'm um actually having a manic episode it's really hot in here i kind of need to turn the car on <laughs> but um that gas money that gas money be be hitting the ac is going now but um you'll handle it so for this project that i'm about to finish i have drafted i think this is my third draft of it that i'm about to complete except i'm about to write the most important scene in the entire book it's like towards the very very end and it's just like such it's a lot out of my element i think but it's also right in my element i know i look like a bug my glasses and like the reflecting of it but i do need to see i just am so nervous about writing scenes like this because when it comes to the important scenes they end up doing fine like when i read them back but doing them just feels like such a headache and such like a like a i'm trying to make it perfect and i think that's the problem it's a lot easier to see the mistakes after like a couple months distancing yourself out from writing so what i need to do is draft it again like make it as good as i can give it a moment to sit and then rework it whenever i reread it i will give it one last reread because the next step is essentially beta readers which i am um i hate it i hate beta readers does anyone actually i actually love beta readers i love it but i i've learned i have learned and love my friends and family don't do beta readers with people that you know <laughs> because not because they won't do it but because because it's so embarrassing like i hate it i hate it i hate it I hate if you're my friend if you're my besties and i have asked you to read my book before no i didn't although i might ask again i'm used to embarrassing myself at this point like they are i feel like they already know it's just the fact that like i'm writing for a younger demographic that i feel like it's dumb to ask somebody my age to read it and be like how good is this what i need is a gaggle of children to just like read <laughs> i just need to find a bunch of children that sounds scary i forget that i'm 19 and i'm like an adult and you can't just say whatever because i'm jail a lot of the times whenever i write i can do it whenever i have free time but with this scene i'm really trying to focus which is kind of rare for me because i'm trying to focus i'm not gonna do it while i eat i was gonna go sit up there and write and eat and be cute but um i can't physically do that so i'm gonna go back to my dorm after i pick up my food eat relax and then try to write this last few scenes i think what's left last time i checked i think there are probably 10 to 12 pages left and then it'll be done and then i'm really excited a lot of times whenever i get towards the end of a project i'm really excited to like be done with it because there's something else in the background that i really want to work on so for this project 
um, I mentioned that I had a first one. I still haven't made up my mind how I want to go about querying it, like with agents and stuff, and how I'm going to start that up again, because I have to rewrite the query letter and the synopsis and a bunch of things I do not want to do. And if that ends up not going the way that I want, I will might try to learn about self-publishing, but I don't really know how that's all going to work out, so I'm not going to think about it. But I know I want to write it regardless, so... I get to just enjoy it where however things go that one I've only had one book done I might need to do a final kind of read I don't know how many final reads I've done on that first project like so many final reads that I've been like oh like one more time I'll read it one more time because it's just always something to change or so now because I've already drafted the second book and I know it's like a big thing with like writers and whatever they'd be like don't don't make a sequel yet don't make a sequel yet because like the whole querying agents like you never know if it's actually gonna get published so there's no point in like writing a second book but that's the thing um have you met me i'm insane and i want to write it regardless so it doesn't even matter but that being said i'm really excited to finish the second project so that i can bounce back and write a sequel because i love the sequel i love it i love it i love it, I love it. i'm the biggest fan girl if no one else is a fan i'm Why do I want to go to sleep? Am I gonna edit or draft or whatever I'm supposed to be doing? But I'm sleepy, so I'm probably being realistic, going to sit on TikTok, shower, and then debate how much I care about finishing this draft today. And we'll see if I actually do. The exact second that I put the camera down, I was reminded I have a play to go watch at seven and it's 5.53. Which basically means I need to take my shower and not sit on TikTok. I, if I just skip the TikTok step, I take a shower, then maybe write, and then it'll be seven o'clock and it's time to go. Girl math, change of plans. Um, I'm just gonna wait. So now I have no excuse but to start writing. So I'm probably just gonna stare at my computer for a couple hours. An hour. I have an hour before I have to be gone. I was just gonna put this to music, but now I feel like doing a voiceover. So this is me writing, posture is horrible, face is confused. This was me finding something that didn't work. Plot hole galore. I don't remember what it was. Um. Oh, actually, I think this is whenever, there was one of my favorite characters that was going through a lot. <laughs> and I did it and I was just like, wow. Like, <laughs> it really is, it really is like this. Like life is really just, wow. This was me getting jump scared, hold on. <laughs> I just jump scared myself. <laughs> the last scenes of these books just, like, you know what I mean? It's just like one thing after another and I've forgotten by now what the heck is happening. And it's just like, it's all hitting the fan, like all of it. And I'm just, I'm grateful all the time. This is how much I have left. 36 out of 42 so basically if I calculate this then it should basically be like Six more pages, so how do I flip this? Six, <laughs> six more pages of this craziness that's happening on this page and this is the part where I was editing something that I could not freaking visualize in my head. The whole point is visualizing thing in your head, like being a writer and everything. That's like the whole gig of it all. But like for some reason, I could not math this. I could not girl math the all and it was making me struggle. Hear me out. If somebody falls head first and somebody catches somebody falling head first, how does that work? You fall? <laughs> You fall, I guess you could like belly flop it. Like you just can fall and like keep going. I need to take physics again. I don't know how I'm gonna write this scene. I'm grateful. I'll tell you what I'm thinking. How I'm thinking about this. If this is a balcony and I'm this tall, if I fall, if I jumped over this thing, I'm belly flopping that, am I? Unless like your feet catch. If you catch somebody belly flop, Do you think I can cheat by having my main character close their eyes so like they don't even see it happen so then I don't have to describe how it happens? Do you? <laughs> because that's what it sounds like I'm finna do. 
<laughs> JK Rowling wants to believe me. It's either, okay, it's either close the eyes and let it happen, leave it up for grab, or just make it like really artsy. So like it's not even clear what's happening. We'll see what I end up doing, I'll let you know. I think I just won't have anybody catch them. I'm gonna just make the character fall and then splat. Just like a little bit. Why are you looking at me like that? So um, what it's looking like is that that's what I'm going with. I don't have time to finish the entire scene because it's time to go. So I'm gonna go, but I'm not gonna bring you. I'll let you know how that goes. I'll let you know if I do anything more tomorrow, tonight, to whatever. Bye for now. Good news, I finished the book. I finished the scene. It's done. So next step is technically beta readers, which means I have to gear up for it, which means I'm gonna do one grammar check. Basically making sure I don't sound dumb, like at least there's grammar in there. If you're gonna fault me on something, fault me on the plot. After I do the grammar edit, I have to like set it up. So basically what I have to do is make the sheets for beta readers. So like they have something to fill out while they're reading the chapter. Once I do that, then I have to find the beta readers. So that'll be so fun and so amazing. And if I don't do it, I'll just full send it. I don't know. But um, that's basically what I'll do. What did I just say? What were my steps? I'm actually really glad that I did this last edit before I thought about sending it to beta readers because I could not have sent whatever draft was before this one to anybody. Like when I tell you the chapter numbers were so messed up, the grammar was so messed up, the spelling was so messed up, and that's the stuff that I could catch like on a first time read. So basically horrendous, but now it's not that bad. It took literally so much energy for me to write that one last scene because it's literally like a character death. I say like character death because like technically I didn't say if they actually died or not because um, I'm just, I'm just that girl, but you know, same dramatics of it all. I had to really like channel that whole scene. Like I had to get some sad music. I had to really, <laughs> I had to make myself sad to make a sad scene. When I learned how to use my tripod, and so I finished what I need to finish essentially. And I'm excited to like start the beta reader thing. I don't know if I'm lying yet, but I think I'm actually just excited to like make the forms and like questions and whatever. I'm not excited about finding people to um, do it because it's either hard or it's awkward. So, oh, so here's the game plan. Oh, work on the other project, come back, do one final read through of like this thing that I just finished because you know, you gotta give it some time to like marinate, to cook, you know what I mean? I'll work on the other project that I'm super, 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 super excited about. Then once I'm done with that, come back, reread it, beta read it. So I like, give it to other folks, take the feedback, then I'll focus on rewiring that. Then that's out of my hands so now i'm even more excited because i don't even have to do beta reads right now that being said you want to beta read let me know logan cc maya you 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 don't want to you know but thank you for watching <laughs> thank you for watching i'll edit this and try to like you know get it out before i graduate like subscribe comment do whatever beta read please but do all the other stuff and i will see you whenever i see you um shout out to mom and dad for giving me a camera I know I had it last video, but like, I love you. All the time, I'm grateful. Okay, bye. <laughs>